All right, while we're here uh, with the fuel tank out, we're gonna go ahead and do what they call harpooning the tank, which basically allows it to be easier to uh, fill the tank completely. Uh, there's a little tail piece that comes down off this line and off this line, it's about that long, and it prevents uh, f uh, easy fill. Now, if you're patient at the fuel pump, and just let it allow the tank to fill at a trickle, it'll naturally settle down and do it itself, but this will speed up the process. What we're gonna do is cut off that line, and we really only need to do it on this uh, main line. Uh, we don't need to do it on the smaller line. So uh, we're gonna cut it off about that far away from the, uh, in the tank wall, and all we need to do is use a PVC cutter like this. And I'm gonna stick the camera inside the tank so you can see what it looks like. Uh, I won't speak during that because it's just sound funky for you, but go ahead and stick it in there so you can see what we're looking at. Okay, here's the cutoff from harpooning or uh, cutting that tailpipe off. And um, as a side note, I have not heard of nor have I seen any ill effects of cutting that pipe off. So uh, it's a good idea if you ask me. I don't even know why they had that excessive tailpipe on there except for afraid of overfilling. So um, I've always overfilled, been patient at the pump, just tired of that, so cut it 